Hey YouTubers, so I wanted to take some studs out of some snow tires that I had because uh, I spent a bunch of money on the tires and I couldn't use them for uh, for the street and uh, we live in Washington State, we might get uh, in uh, the Puget Sound area and we might get two, three days of snow uh, a year so it seems silly to even have them, they're brand new and the tires on my girlfriend's Beetle are shot so what I did was uh, I looked on YouTube and I saw a couple different videos. One guy used WD-40 and some needle nose pliers to pull the, the studs out. And I tried that and that was tedious. And another guy had a, a hammer and a long screwdriver and he would pound in next to the stud and pry it out. And I thought, well, I, I hope that works for him. I don't want to pop a tire. So I thought what I would do is make my own kind of apparatus. So what I did was I took some of these here. Where is it? I can't see it. This thing takes terrible video. Okay, so these are end nippers. Okay, and the end nippers used to have this taper like that with this little channel in there. And uh, that's no good. So I went ahead and got on my grinder and I got another pair and I ground them so that they're completely flat at the top. And uh, I will show you in a moment how I made it work. Okay, here we go. Video showing how to pull studs with end nippers. So these here, because they have that channel in the middle there, they don't grab the stud. And I can't, I can kind of sort of get the end, you can push down, but it just, you can't really get a good pull on it. So what I did is I got a grinder and another pair, ground them down completely flat so that there was no taper on the end uh, in between the nippers. And if you grab it, you can really put a bite on it, pull it straight up and out. And uh, it goes nice and quick. It actually saves the studs if you ever want to reuse them. I don't know if you can or not. Um, I'm going to make a pile and see what happens. But it's really quick, really easy, and I hope that works for everybody.